that. If there were gangs about and that, and you know, um, what, you know, they usually listen to a lot of rap music, and if people came up, sung praise and worship songs, they probably wouldn't be interested. <laughs> Excuse me. But if Lecrae went on the street and started rapping, um, he would probably bring people to Lord on the streets because it's what people listen to, and you've got to get people through music. And I just fancy doing this video. Where am I on here now? This guy, the creator, you know, obviously is reaching people's souls. Um, someone in the hip hop world may not know much about Christianity. Um, they may not know Christian rap. Um, And they might obviously get saved through Christian rappers. You know, I've just mentioned that, and I've, got, I've actually typed this down as well, just in case I'm missing anything. But um, obviously, we can reach people. We can reach people with many different musical genres. It does not have to be worship all the time. You know, worship music is great. Don't get me wrong. But who exactly listens to worship music? Who exactly buys worship music? Only Christians. Think about it. Think about it. And Christian worship artists, you know, they're really rich, well off. A lot of them. Because they get promoted in different ministries and that, but Christian rappers who are trying to make it and Christian rock rock stars, you know, there's Christian metal bands and all. I'm not saying everyone every Christian metal rock band and Christian rapper, you know, are proper Christians and the rap are sing about um, Christianity much, but you've got to support these kind of acts like, like Lecrae and that. And this is just petty stuff, what this guy's put on and judging Lecrae as though he said something really nasty like, or something like, for instance, oh, I worship the devil, I'm not really a Christian. And it's really ridiculous, these sort of videos. These people are reaching for God, and someone has put him down. Someone might put me down on this video, what I'm doing, thinking, Oh, we can do the Nero, yeah, let's expose him. I don't really give a crap, to be honest. It's, it really does my head in. No one's perfect, I know. You listen to something like the Craig, and you'll think, wow, this is really awesome. Um, you know, there are people that will only listen to hip hop, right? And God touches people through different music. Not only have I felt the Holy Spirit from worship and praise music, but I have felt the Holy Spirit through Christian hip hop and Christian rock. And it really it uplifts me and all, you know, when I've got it on in the car, when I'm playing on a game at the same time on the PS3 and I put a CD on, you know, I might be feeling that. It really uplifts me. Now I'm going to read this from the Bible right now. 1 Samuel 18, 10, 11 says, And it happened on the next day that the distressing spirit from God came upon Saul and he prophesied inside the house. So David played music with his hand as at other times, but there was a spear in Saul's hand. And Saul cast the spear, for he said, I will pin David to the wall. 
but David escaped his presence twice. Now I'm now going to read um, 1 Samuel 16.23. I'll read a few different versions, actually. New International Version says, Whenever the Spirit from God came upon Saul, David would take his harp and play, then relief would come um, to Saul, he would feel better and the evil spirit would leave him. English Standard Version and whenever the harmful spirit from God was upon Saul, David took the lyre and played it with his hand, so Saul was refreshed and was well, and the harmful spirit departed from him. And it came to pass, this is the King James 2000 Bible, and it came to pass when the evil spirit from God was upon Saul, that David took a harp and played it with his hand, so Saul was refreshed and was well, and the evil spirit departed from him. So, you know, this does not say that David was singing hymns as well as playing music. He played instrumental music and the spirit went away. You know, the distressing spirit went away. So what I am saying, what am I saying basically, you know, it doesn't necessarily have to be Christian, you know, Christian music, you know, we can feel the Holy Spirit, we can feel the anointing, but any kind of music, you know, as long as it's not demonic or satanic, you know, there's good music all over the world. Um, do you know what I mean? You know, um, classical, some classical music's quite alright, I'm not a big classical fan but it's not too bad but Christian music works wonders whatever the musical style and this is my response and if people are watching this thinking well Matt check out Lecrae you won't be disappointed if you like a bit of rap seriously it's um, it, it is really top notch stuff this so I'm just putting this video on as a response um so bye see ya Man, if that's the highlight, my puff puff pass that You live evaporated like missing a gas cap I guess I'm past that I'm in rebellion I'd rather have a dollar in my pocket than a million I'm scared to watch your money yeah. I want so over Elio I remain a rebel while the rest of them just carry on This is what I live for This the hell I'm buried on If Jesus is the truth, that means one of us is very wrong Think about it But you can't do both Yeah, I know you heard that once in a song I pray you hear ten more for your God Hey, listen up, home Stage is the corner, crowd in the streets And I wrap the bread of life because they dying to eat Hey, I'm a rebel, you know the kind of die in the street Cause you refuse 
Christ with the form, won't eat the king's meat. Yeah. Christ rebelled by shunning the culture. He eating with the sinners, giving Pharisees ulcers. He never got married, he was broke plus homeless. And yeah, that's the God I roll with. Your boy got a wife, yeah. No, I never cheated. I'm praying for humility whenever I get hit. Forget about the drugs, rebel against pornography. This ain't how it ought to be, homie. It's how it's gotta be. Rebel! Drunk and naked, driving around on a loud motorcycle, smoking cigarettes and breaking commandments, and getting pregnant out of wedlock. Everyone's done that. That's so tired.